God of peace and hope give you the fullness of peace. And may the Lord of life be always with you. Brothers and sisters, as disciples of Jesus, we believe that all the ties of friendship and affection which knit us as one throughout our lives do not unravel with death. Confident that God always remembers the good we have done and forgives our sins, let us pray, asking God to gather Father Tom to himself. Lord, in our grief, we turn to you. Are you not the God of love who open your ears to all? Listen to our prayers for your servant Thomas, whom you have called out of the world. Lead him to your kingdom of light and peace, and count him among the saints in glory. Through Christ our Lord.
everyone, uh, just to let you know as the viewing is going on, the praying of the Holy Rosary for Father Tom Bema is now going to commence. It does not in any way interfere with the viewing, which can also go on. But if you want to join with the Rosary, that is also fine. Thank you.
second shout for which the readers is currently not popular. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with joy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail 
Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The fourth sorrowful mystery is the carrying of the cross. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb.
blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord 
blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. heaven, but God the Father of heaven, God the Son, Redeemer of the world, God the Holy Spirit, Holy Trinity, one God, Holy Mary, Holy Mother of God, Holy Virgin of Virgins, Mother of Christ. Mother of the Church, Mother of the Divine Grace, Mother Most Pure, Mother Most Chaste, Mother Inviolate, Mother Undefiled, Mother Most Amiable, Mother Most Admirable, Mother of Good Counsel, Mother of, the, of our Creator, Mother of our Savior, Virgin Most Prudent, Virgin Most Venerable, Virgin Most Renowned, Virgin Most Powerful, 
Virgin Most Merciful, Virgin Most Faithful, Mirror of Justice, Seat of Wisdom, Cause of Our Joy, Spiritual Vessel, Vessel of Honor, Singular Vessel of Devotion, Mystical Rose, Tower of David, Tower of Ivory, House of Gold, Ark of the Covenant, Gate of Heaven, Morning Star, House of the Sick, Refuge of Sinners, Comforter of the Afflicted, Help of Christians. Queen of Angels, Queen of Patriarchs, Queen of Prophets, Queen of Apostles, Queen of Martyrs, Queen of Confessors, Queen of Virgins, Queen of All Saints, Queen Conceived Without Original Sin, Queen Assumed Into Heaven. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, Queen of Families, Queen of Peace, Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God.
reading from the second letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Brothers and sisters, we know that if our earthly dwelling, a tent, should be destroyed, we have a building from God, a dwelling not made with hands, eternal in heaven. We are always clothed, although we know that while we are a home in the body, we are away from the Lord, for we walk by faith. 
this life was the light that was in the grave. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. A man named John was sent from God. He came for testimony, to testify to the light, so that all might believe through him. He was not the light, but came to testify to the light. The true light, which enlightens everyone, was coming into the world. And the world came to be through him. But the world did not know him. He came to what was his own. But his own people did not accept him. But to those who did accept him, he gave power to become children of God, to those who believed in his name, who were born not by natural generation, nor by human choice, nor by a man's decision, but of God. And the word became saw his glory, the glory as of the Father's only Son, full of grace and truth. John testified to him and cried out, saying, This was he of whom I said, The one who is coming after me ranks ahead of me, because he existed before me. From his fullness we have all received grace in place of grace, because while the law was given through Moses, grace and no one has ever seen God. The only Son, God, who is at the Father's side, has revealed him. The Gospel of the Lord. sum of our years is three score and ten, for if we are strong, four score. God did not quite make it to three score and ten for our Indiana delegation at the 70, but Tom did in his life many, many things. Tom moved in many circles. Tom was a member of our ecumenical and faith office. very tough. It told a lot. This one line told very much about Tom's life. He said, he didn't say, I don't want to die. He said, I want to teach. He wanted to keep on going teaching. And that was just the way that he was. All of these wonderful gifts were used to bring Christ to the world. That's the way Tom wanted it. That's the way Tom did it. The man was precise. back uh, from a vacation one summer, and Tom, as always, was in constant contact with the rest of the world, and he was on the phone for quite a long time, and I was about to scold him because he was talking and talking and talking for on vacation, and finally Tom turned to me and said, oh, by the way, the Cardinal says hello. So he 
many responsibilities for the many years it's been in the church and in our world. I doubt if any one person will ever know all the many accomplishments of this wonderful time and knowledgeable man of God. Barbara Abrahano, the current president to 